All right, moving to some other news for now. A new study is getting national attention for how it's grading states for their response to the pandemic. According to that study, which the governor's office disputes, our state got it all wrong. Here's a closer look. The authors of a new study gave New Mexico an F for its COVID-19 response. They say our state's response was the 48th worst out of all 50 states and Washington, D.C. So let's break down why. The study, by the way, is a working paper published by the National Bureau of Economic Research. A working paper, we should note, has not been peer reviewed. The study was written by economist Phil Kirpin of the Committee to Unleash Prosperity. That's a group devoted to promoting the supply side economics touted by President Ronald Reagan. Casey Mulligan, an economics professor at the University of Chicago, who also headed up the White House Council of Economic Advisors for a couple years during the Trump administration as part of this, along with Stephen Moore with a right-wing think tank, the Heritage Foundation. The authors based their study on three factors, the economy, education, and mortality. For the economy, they looked at each state's unemployment rate between April 2020 and December 2021, along with each state's GDP. For education, they looked at the percentage of in-person education for the 2020 to 2021 school year, based on information from event aggregating website Burbio. For mortality, they looked at COVID deaths based on information from a website called usmortality.com. That website claims to get its data from the CDC. It also does not guarantee its correctness. Based on that, the study shows states that performed better generally were smaller and had less restrictive COVID-19 policies. Utah was the top ranked state with high scores in all three categories, fourth in economy, fifth in education, and eighth for mortality. New Jersey came in dead last, scoring 50th in economy, 41st in education, and 42nd in mortality. New Mexico landed in the bottom five, scoring 29th in economy, 45th in education, and 50th in mortality. We reached out to the governor's office for a response to the study. They disputed the data in a statement that reads, the facts are that in the last year, New Mexico was 11th best for job growth in the country overall. In February, the federal government announced New Mexico ranked fifth nationally in employment growth compared to the last year, creating 50,000 additional jobs in the last year.